An investigation into illegal stop signs. Tonight we've learned new details on how some of the nearly 700 stop signs were put up without ever being approved by one local city. The questionable signs were revealed last week following a months-long investigation. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotnik is live with her mobile newsroom with what she's uncovered. And Karen, the bigger issue here tonight is that two-thirds of those illegal stop signs in Cranston remain unaccounted for. Tonight, the mayor's office says the other one-third, they say the State Department of Transportation put those up. The city of Cranston has learned they have nearly 700 illegal stop signs. And now the mayor's office tells Eyewitness News the State Department of Transportation is responsible for putting up some of them. Approximately a third. We're trying to get a, a handle on the numbers now. This is something we discovered late this afternoon. And we're told those stop signs were put up by the state at the entrance to state roads. On city roads, but at the cross of, an, of a state road. And there is a state statute that says that when you reach the intersection of a state right of way, you are to stop before you enter the right of way. So they already have a statute in place that says you have to stop whether there's a sign there or not. And the city says the other two thirds of the illegal stop signs may have been installed by Cranston Public Works or residents themselves. We're still working on those two thirds as far as what we're going to do with that situation. Where they came from dates back years. Um, anecdotally, people will tell you that, you know, in years past, they, you know, they would call City Hall and a sign would go up. And we're talking many years ago, decades ago. And we did put a call into the State Department of Transportation. They say at this point they will not comment because they don't know where, where rather, all of those stop signs are. And the mayor's office says drivers, of course, should not take this as a free pass because a stop sign, of course, is a stop sign. For now, we're reporting live tonight with the Mobile Newsroom. I'm Catherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.